Hey guys, uh, Jack here. It's a pretty, uh, pretty decent sized mail day. Bunch of stuff. Um, over the past week or so, I've got most of, uh, almost all this stuff in. So, uh, let's get straight into it. We got uh, this Peyton Manning red, white, and blue disco I got from 2016 Prism. You guys know I've been big on Peyton Manning stuff. He's so cheap. A lot of his. I'm, I've been looking at some rookie stuff. I bought a lot of his second year like cool inserts. And then I started buying this 2016 Prism because it's his first Prism card in a Colts uniform, where he's a lot more famous for. So picked up that bad boy for like on bid for like twenty, for like uh, twenty, it's five bucks, six bucks maybe. This was uh this I bought earlier, like the first week of May. Finally came in, came with some some hoops base. But this I meant to buy, bid eighteen dollars in this card in the backs, and I bid eighteen hundred. So I got it for twenty eight bucks, which is more than I was wanting to pay, but. I mean, I feel like I'm still okay with paying that price. Some hoops base he threw in. Lucas Simonic rookie. But the main card was pretty sweet. It actually came from China, so that's why it took so long. But, uh, the Donovan Mitchell from 1718, uh, Impeccable. This is just the base rookie, number 2499. Impeccable is just a fantastic set. A lot of people love it. And like a lot of people, I think this is probably, probably Panini's best high-end set. I love the canvas feel. I love the design always. This nice on-card autos are pretty sweet. So, yeah. Pretty cool Don and Mitchell there. I'm big on Mitchell stuff. I think he's very undervalued. Oh, this is a sweet card. These I got this for five bucks on auction, four dollars shipping, ninety nine cents. I was the only person who placed a bid. As good as it gets, these are like one in almost like one two hundred eighty something packs. So yeah, nineteen ninety nine Fleer Ultra. I'm thinking about picking up a box of this. Not sure, but I might pull the trigger. But that was a sweet card of Peyton. Uh, this is a PC pickup. I made an offer for this guy. He had twenty dollars for auction or best offer. I offered him fifteen bucks, I think, or maybe it was twenty five. I offered him twenty. Yeah, that was what it was. But a JD Davis purple autograph from fifteen Bowman, Chroma, seven of two fifty for the PC for the Mets. But I like how JD Davis is like rookies and prospect cards. Even though he's not on the Mets, he's on the Astros. At least the Astros colors kind of look like the Mets. So when I'm looking through my Mets cards, it's cut. You know, if you look through it quick, you can't really even tell the difference. But JD was fantastic last year. Had a great year hitting. Made a couple of pretty cool plays in the field. Although he's a little, he's not the best fielder, but he's serviceable. This card was awesome. This was eight bucks shipped, and um, this is a big PC card. It's not like a big card, but it's just awesome. One of my favorite players growing up. Probably my second favorite Met of all time. This is a rookie from 2000, uh, 2000 top traded, 2001, 2001 top traded. Uh, you know, each year's year, pull horses year. And this is the gold rookie card of Jose Reyes. Number 1939 at 20, 2001. And it's in pretty good shape. A little off-center, though, but still, I mean, Jose Reyes had a great career. He was a great player. One of the best shortstops in baseball for a while. One of the best, uh, the best, the best base dealer in baseball for a while, too. Very, always loved Jose. Especially when he, that, when he came back to the Mets for, for a couple years. After he went to the Rockies, Blue Jays, and Marlins already. And that, especially that one game where he pitched. And it was just, he's just having so much fun when the Nationals crushed the Mets. So that was pretty cool. Uh, this next lot, I won an auction for around 10 bucks, uh, 5 bucks, I believe. Uh, just some Don Russ color cards. We got some reds of Soroka from this year's Don Russ. Two of those. A Dozier, Blackman, Trey Turner, Chris Sale, Devers. Two Yellishes. Um, Eugenio Suarez, like the Rapture parallel. And the main reason I bought a lot was just because I figured this was probably close to $5 card itself. A Boba Shett, Ray Rookie Blue, and it actually looks good enough for grading, so I might send this in, I might not, I don't know. It's like a very common parallel from Don Russ, but it is Boba Shett, so maybe. But still, I figured, I mean, the Boba Shett at least pays for a lot, then plus, you know, I sell these, a couple of these for a buck a piece. Pretty solid deal. Um, next, I'll get into this. This was from a couple, a gr here's some group break stuff I got. This was, uh, I got into a one box jumbo box, one jumbo box break of the from Instagram of triangle cards of the Rangers is for eight bucks plus three fifty shipping, but pretty good deal especially since the Rangers have Sam Huff who's autograph sell was selling for like, I think a hundred bucks at the time maybe maybe eighty bucks I don't know maybe six I don't know they were selling very well so I figured I'd pick them up. That's what I got some rookies here I sleeved up uh, the Chromes Josh Young Chrome a Sam Huff base Chrome first Chromes so that's not bad. Sharon Apostle, a lot of people like him. First base Chrome, and I did have a parallel, number parallel out of one jumbo box, so pretty good. 109 out of 125, this is the Aqua Leo de Taveras. So not terrible right there. And I, he also, I guess he threw in a pack of contenders. Football, I don't know if this is retail or hobby. I can't tell. I think this might be retail, actually, because it's eight cards, but yeah, actually, no, this is probably a blaster pack. 
But still, you know, Contenders 2015. Yeah, from Melvin Gordon for the PC. Doesn't look like we got anything though. Let's see, JJ Watt, Baldwin, Malcolm Floyd, for the PC. There you go, Peyton Manning, been buying some of his stuff, as you guys have seen. Drew Nelson, oh, cool, die cut. Oh, that's nice. And Odell, one of these pennant cards, second year Odell pennant. That's a cool card. So, okay, now, a solid little pack right there. One of those beeping things. I'll have to sleeve these bad boys up. Um, and then we have some group break wins from Card Collect 2 on eBay. Uh, from Card Collect 2 on Instagram. But got these on his website. Uh, there was two breaks. There was a basketball mixer with a bunch of 2020 stuff. You know, some Prism Optic, Crown Royale, Mosaic. That was 100 bucks for a random team. And then same, another random team break, but with 2020 Bowman Retail. Some blasters, hangers, you know, cellos, whatever, all, that, all that jazz. So that was 30, uh, 20, 28 bucks, I believe. So also got the sticker. I got... I didn't get the best team either, but I did get good teams. For basketball, I got the Heat. You know, they got Tyler Hero, Kendrick Nunn, and Optic, and uh, Mosaic, and uh, Casey Akpala, plus, you know, D Wade stuff. And then I got the Rays and Bowman, you know. None of the big first guys except for Vidal Bruhan. You can hit autos of him, which he's a pretty big one. And plus, you have Wanda Franco stuff. So uh, here's the uh, basketball first. Some base here. You know, Jimmy Butler. Base from Prism, Ray Allen, D Wade All Stars from uh, uh, Optic, a fast break parallel of Goran Dragic, a couple base rookies of Casey Akpala, uh, pretty cool one here, nice one here, Kendrick Nunn base rookie, the no name, which is they're all like that, but uh, it's a pretty solid card. Another solid one right here, a D Wade uh, green from Mosaic, the, and this is the USA version, um, a Casey Akpala silver rookie, not bad. People, have, I've seen some people like hyping him up a little bit recently. Like I've seen people, a lot of people asking for his stuff on Instagram. And we did hit a Tyler Hero Base Prism, which looks good enough for grading. So I might send this in a PSA. I know tens of these are doing for like around 100 bucks. So, you know, this, if this tens, it pays for the break. So not bad there. And then the Rays. We got a lot of good amount of stuff for the Rays. Some Vet Base. Um, some Prospect Paper. We got a Wanda Franco paper prospect, not bad there. Joe, so first Joe Ryan, two Nico Hustlers, Hustler, I don't know. Uh, a Jan Diaz, and two Ruben Cardenas. First some Crumbs, Libertor, a couple of Bazes, Ra, Ronaldo Hernandez, a Chroma Fr Franco. Then we have the camos of Ronaldo Hernandez, and then two Wanda Franco camos, which is pretty nice. And then we have a Ronaldo Hernandez Bowman Chrome top scouts top 100. I like the look of this these year. This year, like I like the look of these this year. Last year I wasn't too big on them. Two years ago I liked them, and I like them again this year. And then we did hit a Wanda Franco paper, which looks good enough for grading. So pretty sweet there. So I think the Francos will basically pay for this break, or at least the Francos will come. This break I probably make my money back. The Francos, you know, the Camos sell for like six bucks a pop. The Chrome sells around four. And you sell the other stuff, you know, a couple of other cards. And then lastly, I got some personal packs with Anthony Hockey. And this is kind of a, you know, I like Anthony, he's a nice nice guy. But these cards, I mean, there were so many of them came in damaged. I got like 20 something, close to the, between 15 and 20 packs of Donruss, 1415 basketball, and one pack of Elite, uh, one hanger pack of Elite, 2017 Elite Traffics football. And I said there's about 100 cards total I got. You know, he, he ships the star, the inserts, rookies, and stars for base. But I think it was 20, 24 cards, I believe it was, came with damaged corners. Because he only sent two of the cards in top letters and only a couple cards in sleeves, like less than five. And there was no, like, cardboard or anything to protect them. There they were just some team bags in there. Like, look at all those corners. See what I mean? And there are some decent cards in here, you know what I mean? Like, there's a numbered card right there. A Steph Curry. A LeBron. A Jersey card. Some rookies, some inserts. Marcus Smart, Rakino. Westbrook. Another numbered card. Dirk. Another rookie. So, I mean, I don't know. That was kind of... That really sucks. Really, really sucks. So, here's the rest of the stuff. I don't know. That just really bummed me out when I saw that. It's not like, you know, there's like a $100 card that's like that, but still, it's the principle. 
Oh, here's the rest of the stuff I got. Nothing crazy. McCaffrey. Just even like some of these cards, like still the corners aren't really that good. Like McCaffrey. That's not bad. Uh, yeah, that one's fine. Was one of these cards in sleeves was terrible. Uh, I guess these ones are these ones are okay. But still. I don't know. Jabari Parker, Michael Carter Williams jerseys. Swirl of Rama, Jernero Stokes. And actually, I did hit a, a base of Giannis, but I, tri I let him keep that. I sold it to him for like five bucks. Five bucks off the some of the, some of the packs. And you might get go Chris numbered card. Another numbered rookie at 99, Wiggins rookie. LeBron, Steph Curry, Swirl of Rama.